No, we can always use a little more pizzazz. Indeed. Dina Kupfer is live with some local kiddos who are revamping our studio tree. Good morning, Dina. <laughs> Good morning. You know I love my Dina IY segments, but this morning I'm soliciting the help of some students here at Needham Elementary in Lodi. Students, good morning. Good morning. And not to judge and be biased, but this might be one of the most well-behaved first grade classes that we've ever been to. You all are doing such a great job. This is Ms. Jaymont's class, so I'm going to bring it her over. Good morning to you. Good morning. And how long have you been teaching? Uh, this is my 22nd year. <gasps> Oh my gosh, first grade the whole time? No, okay. no, no, no. I taught upper grades for about 10 years and then I've been teaching first in kindergarten okay. since then. Well, you are doing an excellent job because these students are just little gems, little angels. Oh. Okay, so this is the little reindeer project that they're working on. Talk about what they are doing today. So today we are, we, so before we had already painted the, the bodies and such, today they're doing the final touches on it, cutting out the faces, the tails, the antlers, and then adding on the little decorations. Yeah, and I'm so excited. We're going to take these ornaments back, students and we're going to decorate one of the trees in our Good Day studio, one of our holiday trees, so they get to see their work on set for the remainder of the holiday season. And I know Miss Jamon's been teaching them all about reindeer yes. for the whole week, so I'm actually going to put the kiddos to the test here as they're in the middle of working. So we have a little Addie here. Addie, I know you talked to Miss Jamon about reindeer. Do you know their favorite treat to eat? Mm -hmm. Moss. And what color is the moss that they typically eat? White. It is. And what color moss do we have here? Green. It's kind of green, huh? Isn't that interesting? And then also, I know, Alice, you're working hard over here. We also learned that do boy and girl reindeers get antler or uh, reindeer get antlers, or is it only one? Um, boys and girls. Yeah, that's pretty special. Do you remember how big the antlers are? Um... Three feet. Yeah, three feet. That might be as tall as me, actually. So that's a pretty big set of antlers. Uh, we are going to be with these students as they continue to finish up these projects. And then in the next half hour, we're going to collect all of the reindeer from them so that we can bring them back to the studio. They've also got a special song that they've been working on because they have a holiday program coming up next week. Students, do you want to share a little bit of your song? Not now, but in the next half hour? Yeah. Yes. Yes? Okay, good. Well, then coming up in the 9 o'clock hour, you get to hear these students sing, and we will also see their completed reindeer as well as part of this project. Thank you, Miss Jamon's class. Stay close. Good day. We'll be back right after this.